Hi guys, it's Crazy Coupons. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we are gonna be going over the new clearance markdowns and penny list for this week at Dollar General. But first, before we get started, if you haven't already subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting on, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's right down below this video. And while you're at it, do your girl a huge favor, hit that thumbs up button and leave me a smile down in the comment section below because those are two quick, easy, and free ways that y'all can help support this channel. And then take a second to share the video. All right guys, now first up, just a quick friendly reminder that I did upload a video yesterday on Sunday going over all our new coupons, new glitches. We have freebies and money makers. So if you missed that video, make sure that you go and check it out. It's going to be linked for you in the pinned comment down below. And now let's go ahead and jump right into our new clearance markdowns and penny list for this week at Dollar General. Y'all, please keep in mind that these prices will not change until Tuesday morning when the doors open, and that is going to be March the 12th. So first up, we have our red dot home category dropping down to 70% off starting on Tuesday, March the 12th. This is a huge category. We have everything from bath towels, kitchen items, pillows, you name it. And I do have a full visual video coming up for you all next. So make sure that you stay tuned. Make sure that you have those notifications turned on and set them to all. That way you don't miss out on any crazy deals. All right, up next, we have select picture frames dropping down to 90% off starting on Tuesday, March the 12th. So for this category, I have put together a few visuals for you all and huge shout out and thank you to those crazy couponers who sent in their pictures as well. That is always super, super, helpful. Now a couple of quick notes on this category. This does not mean that all of the picture frames are included in this clearance markdown. It is on select picture frames. The ones that I have found that are automatically ringing up correctly at the register, meaning that the employees do not have to manually override them or manually adjust the price down, are the picture frames without the cardboard packaging. And you guys are going to see those here in a minute. I did include the UPC codes for all of the ones that I have found so far at my stores. However, in a previous video, I did see a couple of comments saying that they found some of the picture frames with the cardboard packaging around them that were included as well. So with this category, it is going to be very, very important to scan, scan, scan before you go up to the register and also make sure that you have your correct store location set in your Dollar General app. All right, guys, now we're going to move on into our penny list for this week at Dollar General. So if you are new to penny shopping, please keep in mind that we do not ask the employees about penny items, penny sales, penny lists, whatever you want to call it. We do not talk to the employees about penny items. That is the number one rule of penny shopping. All you need to do is go into your local Dollar General stores, look for the items that I'm going to show you all in this video. If you find them, scan the barcode with your Dollar General app, make sure your correct store location is set, and if the item scans and the price shows up at 000 or 001, that means that you have in fact found a penny item. And if you want to take a look at the penny policy, it is always posted for you over on the community tab. Now, this week at Dollar General, we have our holiday storage category dropping down to one penny starting on Tuesday, March the 12th. So here's a look at all the items that are included in this category. I know that a lot of you all have seen these multiple times, but hey, remember, the more that you take a look at visuals, the more that you see these items, the easier it is going to be once you go into the store and actually start penny shopping. Now, a couple of quick things to take note of with this category. I am not going to be the one that sits up here and tells you all that these are going to be easy to find because we have had these items on the sales floor since way before Christmas. Then they went on clearance. They have been on clearance forever. It is now March. These were Christmas storage items. Plus, this category was also included in our clearance event. And to top it all off, these are storage items. So these were already hot ticket items as soon as these joined our clearance markdown. So no, these are not going to be easy to find. But like I always say with Dollar General, you never know what you're going to find until you get out there and just see what your store has in stock. And I will say, Every single year, I at least find a handful of these items. Last year, I found the wreath bags and the tree bags. The year before that, I found the little decorative boxes, the small uh, shoe boxes. So these items are still out there. You just have to get out there and look. Look high, look low, look everywhere you go. You never know what the employees are going to pull out from the back. They may have some old stock that they pull out and throw on the top shelf. So just look high, look low, look everywhere you go 
and scan, scan, scan. All right, guys, so that wraps up our new clearance markdowns and penny list for this week at Dollar General. Please remember to always be kind to your employees, and I hope that you all have a fantastic week. And that's going to be it for me for now, but y'all know the drill. Stick around and stay tuned because I have more crazy deals coming at you all very, very soon. So before you go, make sure you're subscribed, hit that thumbs up, and leave me a smile down in the comment section below. All right, guys, thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope y'all have a a beautiful day and I will see you on the next one.